Hi there, my name's Alfie, I'm part of the sales team here at Grantham's and today I'll be taking you around the Elite 560 2023 model for you and giving you a feel of the interior and exterior of the caravan as we go through it. So, where better to start than the exterior of the caravan and we will start with the front facing area of it. As you can see, you've got the nice kind of matte finish, matte carbon finish across the front locker which can store two gas bottles inside along with here at Grantham's we will bring it with standard inside it with the water pump, the electric cable, the step and the steady winder inside there as well on day of collection. As we move down as well to the A-frame you've got all the items and bits and pieces for hitching up there as well along with on this caravan we do have the ATC module installed as well. So as we move to the left hand side you've got the nice blue and grey finish down the side with the extra little details of the metallic birds. And then just down here at the bottom, we do have the battery area, along with all the where the electrics can be plugged in. You've got your water intake system, along with an external shower point as well for all the dogs, or any dirty bikes at all that you've got with you. Moving across as well. So you'd move across, you do have the toilet cassette area here as well, along with all the bits and pieces to put the fluids in there. And then as we move across, You've got an external storage point here as well, which can lead into inside the caravan. And then moving around to the back end, you've got your LED lights, which when connected up to the car will do all the braking and everything like that as well. So all the lights connected as well as standard on all Swifts. You've got the area so where you can fit a bike rack, which is nice and simple. So if you're someone who bikes around when they go caravan, you can get it fitted and it's all there and ready for you. Then as we move across to the habitation side, same again on this side, you've got an external storage point which can lead inside the caravan and it is accessible from both exterior and interior. You've got the same nice finish across here as well. And then just on this side, you do also have a 230 volt socket, external TV point, which when lifted up, it's nice and simple. You plug the TV in, you have it set up so when you're and everything, so you can watch TV while you're relaxing as well. And then moving across again, You've got an external barbecue point and then just another external storage point which leads to underneath the sofas. So now I'll take you inside into the interior of the caravan and give you an idea of what that feels like as well. So we're now in the interior of the caravan and where better to start than the lounge area itself. As you can see, you've got both sofas corresponding to each other on each side. So you've got all the space for all the family to sit across them, eat, have, relax, watch some TV and everything as well. And then you do have the overhead lockers all the way across on both sides, which are nice open storage spaces. This one does have the cassette, er the radio cassette area here. And whereas the rest of them are just nice open storage spaces, some with shelving space, but like this one, it's just a nice open space. And then speaking of watching TV, you do have a TV point. down this side and then you've just got the socket point on the other side as well so that if you wanted to you can fit a tv point on that blank space or you can put a usb x section in there just makes it nice and simple for you and as you can see in this car and you've got the nice color scheme with the finish all the way through the same with the worktop you've got a nice finish across it which in the kitchen area you do have the microwave centerized and you do have the two storage spaces on both sides this one is a nice open one which does have the solar panel in there. So you don't have to use anything on that. As long as you can see that green flashing light, you know the solar panel's on and it's working. Whereas on this side, it's a bit more of an open space and you do have the bit areas where you can put your plates on so that nice and safe during travel. And you've got the microwave itself. Moving down again, you've got the fridge freezer here as well, which does open on both sides. So you've got plenty of space inside it. Same again with the freezer. So if you're taking items, going away for a weekend, going away for a week, you don't have to worry, you've still got all the storage for it. Same again with here, just a nice pull out drawer. And then you've got all the extra bits and items for the kitchen area inside there as well. And then moving across to the oven, you've got the main oven bit down here at the bottom with the grill, which does have the, currently have the grill pan inside it. And then moving up, you've got three gas hobs here as well. And then you've got one electric one. 
so that you can just switch back and forth depending on what you've got hooked up. Moving across to this side, so same again, you do have another TV point here with a nice little extra addition of shelving units there. And then just as we move across, you do have your entire control panels. As you can see, this caravan is Audi heating, so it's all the underfloor heating system. And then you've got the main control panel, which does control all your battery powers, your awning lights, any of the water levels, and just your main lighting system itself. So as we move forward into the caravan, first thing you notice is the you come straight into the bathroom area as you go through, so it is a central bathroom. You've got the large mirror there, as you can see, just as an extra addition. To give you that nice little touch, you've got the sink area here. Then moving to the left side, you've got the toilet there, and you do have some storage space just up there as well. Which does open up, and it's just a nice little area full of shelving units. And then on this right-hand side, you do have the shower in the corner, and just above me as well, you do have a nice little skylight almost, which opens up nice and simply just by pressing this button and then pulling it down. So if you want to let all the steam out, it's fa fairly simple to do. And then as we move across into the bedroom area, as you can see, the be bed is centered in the middle with both wardrobes on either side. And you've got the overhead lockers just there as well. As you come into the wardrobes, as you can see, you do have lots of space. This one does have the Audi fluid in, along with the satellite in as well. So it does take away a little bit of it, but you've still got loads of space for your clothes. Same again as we move down. This is just a bit more of an open space for all the extra bits of clothes that you've brought. But you don't have to worry. So if you do come away for a week and you've brought lots and lots of clothes, you will fit it all. Same again as we move across to the other side of the bedroom for this wardrobe. As you can see, this one does have the fold-away table tucked inside it. But other than that, you've got a lot of open space for lots of clothes. And for these overhead lockers, both of them are the same with the shelving space inside for the full storage. With the bed as well, it is an underbed storage area. So all it is, is hook underneath, pulling up. At the moment, you've got your spare tyre there, along with all the carpets in underneath but it's got all that addition of the storage base as well. So I'll quickly do a tour around the caravan for you so you can get one last look of the interior. Do you also have here, just as the last point, you've got another TV point and you can fit a TV bracket into here. So if you wanted to just watch TV in bed, relax before you go to sleep, it can be done. And then just above me as well here, just with the skylight in front of me, you do have an omni vent there. So if you are cooking and you want to let out all the steam that's being produced, you can just switch it on and it will let it all out for you. So there we are for you. That is the Elite 560 2023 model for you. I hope you've enjoyed. If you do have any questions regarding the caravan itself or any further inquiries, please feel free to contact me or any other salesperson here at Grantham's at 01476 560599. Thank you. Have a good day.